Uh, I've just gone through some of the settings here, so we'll just have a quick look, see if I've not missed anything. Uh, so the sound, I've got uh, disable copyright music on, although I know I saw the tweet and it, there's at least one song that is copyrighted and is not filtered out. Um, and what they've said is, during the first two brain dances or something, mute the audio. I'm, I'm taking a different approach. I'm not taking any chances here. So I've disabled the VOD creation. So this stream will not be available on Twitch as a VOD, but this stream will be available on my YouTube Scroll Plus channel. FYI, because I'm not, I'm just, I don't trust, trust um, Twitch's DMCA system right now. So I'm not, I'm not taking that chance and leaving a VOD line around. Um, clips are turned on for subs, um, but obviously I would ask you just to be a bit careful with that. Uh, don't clip during any of the brain dance stuff because, you know, it might have music in. And I don't want any clips to um, lead to a problem either, so please don't do that. Um, I leave it in your hands as subs to be um, to be sensible about clip creation. Preferably when there's no music running would be ideal. Uh, music volume, I've dialed it back to 75. I've left that on studio reference because, like, the option... That's probably a little bit loud. Hang on. <laughs> Cookie, Cookie Gamer, thank you very much for gifting uh, five subs to the community, Cookie. Appreciate that, mate. Thank you for the support. And if you just got one, please give Cookie a massive thank you and some squirrel gifting chat for Cookie. Mr. Munro, uh, 47 months. A Bandita with 43. Thanks for entertainment. Thank you for the support, Bandita. Kill Tiger, 34. Uh, many more ahead. Thank you, mate. Uh, is this with the day one patch? I don't know, dude. Like, I, I, I think so. I, I've started it from Steam. Whatever Steam's currently got is what I've got. I don't know if they rolled out day one patch. Uh, I, I simply have no way of knowing. I know that I pre-installed the game, and then at midnight it installed about five gigabyte patch. Now that could have been day one patch, or it could have been um, unlock patch. I, I, I don't know. 5 gigs sounds like content, so maybe that was the day one patch. Cyberpunk ad, lol. <laughs> cyberpunk ad on a cyberpunk playthrough, that's hilarious. Uh, cinematics. I've left all good this. Good morning, sir. Um, Fletcher, good morning to you. Fletcher Reed, thank you for the bits. Cup of tea will be splendid. Mrs. Squirrel is currently out. There is nobody in the house that can make me a cup of tea right now. Dark times. She's down at the hairdresser. Um, I've left all this. I don't know what sensitivity I'm going to need, so until I get in the game, I, I will not know. Uh, graphics, we've we've got on max everything. It's defaulted to by the look of it. Hello, Paul. This is the text-to-speech man here. What is this Thursday stream shenanigans? I thought my contract was Friday to Sunday. <laughs> I hope you're paying me extra SQRL, Ross. <laughs> Anonymous Moose, thank you, sir. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we've got... Um, yeah, that, that's pretty much it, and everything's like that. I literally haven't clicked this yet. Subtitles are turned on, because I like subtitles in uh, in playthroughs. That's still making me laugh. Mr. Senaton, thank you for 40 months. Contract Friday to Sunday, I love it. Um, right, so yeah, we're going to click on playthrough. Um, normally, I, you know, in playthroughs like this, I try not to say much during, um, like, dialogue scenes. So I generally shut up during dialogue scenes. So, you know, if you do resub or whatever, just be, be aware of that. Uh, don't max out the ray tracing. Stripping on 3090, try to max everything out and drop so many frames. It was unreal. Okay, so max on the ray tracing. Uh, that was down here, wasn't it? Ray tracing is on ultra at the moment. Which looks like there's another level after Ultra. That's interesting. What what does Ultra mean if there's a setting after Ultra? Mega Ultra? No, no. Nudity's turned on. Everything... No, we're not We're not dialing that back. Look, nudity sensor's off, right? This, this game... This is an 18 game, guys. The mature flag is on. This is not PG. You know, there's, there's going to be nudity in this game there's going to be swearing there's going to be violence it's full-on game just be very aware of that 
50 gig day one patch. I've never heard of that. No, so Twitch, I had a read through the Twitch Terms of Service, and I can link that to you if you want to. Uh, the Twitch Terms of Service dictates that if there's nudity in a game, such as this, then you are allowed to play through that nudity as long as you don't basically hang around and you don't repeat it. Like, you just literally, if it's part of the game, if it's part of the game's playthrough, you play through it and that's fine. If you focus on it or make it the attention of the stream or keep repeating it, then that's not fine. That's the Twitch Terms of Service. I had a read. Uh, Mr. Yui Hirasawa. Fun fact that to, 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 to do some anime called Stein's Guy. I did not know that. I did not know that. That's cool. Uh, you can try maxing it, but we won't ray trace and destroys frames. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know about that. We'll just have to see. If the frames are tanked, then I'll, I'll reevaluate. Let me just give you a quick... Where did I keep that? One second... Trying to find. I'm trying to find that TOS link for you. Ah, oh, there it is. There it is. All right, mods, can you keep hold of a copy of this, please? If you if you go on that bit there and you scroll down to where it says um, prohibited sexual games and game modifications. Uh, games featuring nudity, pornography, sex, blah, 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 are prohibited. Custom gameplay visual modifications include it, including censored, otherwise allowed to play, blah, blah, blah. Focusing your broadcast around sexual content or in-game nudity or otherwise allow it, allowed game will result in enforcement action against your Twitch account. When interacting with an in-game nudity or sexual content in a permitted game, users may only spend as much time as is required to progress. Yeah. In addition, users may not engage in simulated sexual activity or erotic roleplay, which includes specific behaviors uh, with other players online. So that last bit's about multiplayer type stuff. But it says you can you can have in-game nudity or sexual content in a permitted game, which this is, uh, as long as you only spend as much time as required to progress through it, essentially. Uh, Squirrel, your face is familiar. Are you in the game truckers? And, uh, I'm in ETS as one of the drivers, if that's what you mean, and ATS. Dr. Introvertius with 10 months, heads to another month, loving cyberpunk so far, can't wait to meet Keanu. Wait, you're going to meet him? Hogster, 83, bing bong, your implants are here. Did you order the 338 double D? No, I did not, Hogster. No, that was for pups, actually. Right. Are we ready to rock and roll? I can't see the mature flag. Dude, I turned it on. I literally turned it on. Let me double check that. Uh, channel mature content flag is turned on let me take a screenshot there's the proof it is turned on right I'm gonna put 18 plus game in the title there you go. Super clear. Mature flag on. 18 plus in the title. Um, I've even got my mature flag, which I can bring in. Uh, which I shall put, like, here, maybe. There you go. I mean, I, I can't do any more than this, can I? <laughs> what, what else can we do here? Yeah. If you don't know that Cyberpunk's a mature game, then I don't know what to say. <laughs> yeah, so PC Tech, what that is, if you see my glasses, you see that black thing there? That's the reflection of the light, which is up here, see? If I do that, you don't get it. It's weird. The green screen behind me reflects somehow off that light, hits the glass, gets filtered out by OBS. I don't get it, but whatever. Can't fix it. Coffin Dodger, thank you for three months. Sorry, for three subs gifted. Can we get some squirrel gifting chat for Coffin Dodger? And if you got a sub, please give Coffin Dodger a thank you. Right, new game. Let's go. Uh, hard, very hard. 
Combat will be a substantial challenge. The effective use of perks, cyberware, combat gadgets, and consumables will be essential to survive. Buckle up for a serious challenge. Careful character development. Clever use of game mechanics. Blah, blah, blah. I'm going to go for hard, I think. Like, I want to be able to play through this without repeating scenes again and again and again, which tends to happen with very hard. So, I don't want normal, because it'll just be too easy. Bullet sponging. Actually, if you go very hard, they will super bullet sponge as well, which is really annoying. The RTX on the glasses is too high. Yep, quite literally. So, we'll go hard. Nomad Street Kid and Corpo. Select, uh, select versus life path. Some events and dialogue options in the game will be different depending on your choice. Nomad. Roaming the Badlands, looting scrap yards, raiding fuel depots. Life on the road wasn't easy, but growing up in Nomad Clan is its perks. Honesty, integrity, and a love of freedom. Qualities that few in Night City possess and no amount of money can buy. Interesting. Interesting. Thank you, William. Uh, street Kid. They say if you want to understand the streets, you got to love them. Gangs, fixers, dolls, small-time pushers. You were raised by them all. Down here in the law of the jungle dictates the weak of the strong. The only law in Night City you don't have yet to break. And Corpo. Few leave the corporate world with their lives. Few are still with their souls intact. You've been there. You've bent the rules. Exploited secrets and weaponized information. There's, not, there's no such thing as a fair game. Only winners and losers. Ooh. Hmm. That's a tough one. That's a very Mad Max experience, I guess. This is your atypical one, isn't it? This is what I reckon most people would go for this. Your atypical street kid. And I reckon not too many would go for Corpo. That's what I'm thinking. Jack Garrett, thank you for 26. Really gassed us. Rip, dude. You'd be wrong on that one. What, you reckon most people go Corpo? Interesting. I would have thought a lot of people would have gone street kid. This might give you the ability to move around freely a bit more. Because you know, you've got contacts. This one is probably going to do if you need to get, if you need to hustle thing, get a gang together. And this one might be sort of security, cybernetic type stuff. Contacts maybe, I don't know. Lots of people have gone no, but corporal from what you've seen. Wow, so not many have gone street kid. You did a Nomad Stealth Netrunner. I have no idea what comes after this. That's the problem. I don't know what comes after this choice. I quite fancy a high-tech corporate kind of playthrough. I quite fancy, um, like, proper full-on hacking tech, tech stuff. You know what I mean? And I think Corpo might suit me a bit more in that respect. Let's see what happens after this. Body type. Hmm. Select versus body type versus appearance. Some may affect the behavior of other characters. Interesting. It may affect the behavior of other characters. I wonder how that works. I guess it depends if you're male or female, maybe. Or is this game just completely gender neutral? Not much seems cool. I don't fancy Nomad, to be honest. Uh, Mr. Zorowax, thank you for 33. Greetings from Germany. Is he going to have a mean beard? That's a good point. <clears throat> we could, like, try and create a cybernetic version of me. <laughs> oh, boy. What's... What the... There's some... Oh, that's a random, I see. I see, I see, I see. Wow, this is pretty cool. Look at this. This is full on freaky. What's with a green beard? What's with this? Who would who would have an implanted like a bright green beard? Oh wow. That's all kinds of weird, man. The lipstick. <laughs> I like this. I quite like this this purple random beard. I'm really not liking the mouth very much. <laughs> the, the little lipstick here. Oh, wow. That's just... This is crazy, man. It just shows you where humanity could go, though. I'm V. I'm V. I'm V. 
I'm V. Wait, has this got... I'm V. Has this got a slider or is it just... I'm V. I'm V. Wait, so you can actually have a male-looking character with a female voice? I'm V. That's, that's really, really weird. A guy with a woman's voice? I'm V. I'm V. I'm V. I'm V. That's just nuts. <laughs> Skin tone. Wait, what was that? Oh, I see. We need to, we need to be like proper, full on, completely weird. I don't think that I don't think that brown suits him with the green beard though. I like that. I, I like the ways. I like the ways uh, her glows when he does this. Skin type. Like there are five different skin types. Hairstyle. <laughs> oh my god, this is amazing. It's actually amazing. That is epic. Epically bizarre. There's no way you could be any kind of... I don't know. How would you not stand out? If you was trying to be stealthy and stuff, how could you not stand out looking like this? That just looks... Yeah, okay. Actually, I actually want to change the hair color. I want to go with something a bit more green. There we go. Now we're talking. Now we can look like an NVIDIA fanboy. <laughs> Snooker man, thank you for 45 months. True, everyone stands out. Really slain. Lol. Benjamin, thank you for 8 months. I mean, we could change his beard color as well, I guess. Depends what color actually looks pretty impressive. I like the green, actually. I'm going to stick with the green. Let's try and get a, a hairstyle that works. Oh, wow. Look at that. That looks amazing. I love this. There's so many cool hairstyles. I'm not a fan of the Sonic the Hedgehog look. That's a little bit too... Japanese kind of samurai look. That's a bit... That's a bit boy band. What else should we go with? It's a typical, atypical punk look, isn't it? You have an afro, right? Well, we did have a kind of an afro. What does that remind me of? Oh, I know what that reminds me of. Lo um, Planet of the Apes. Like That's like the ape haircut. <laughs> pretty wild. It's, it's going to be completely like rad. That's that's hilarious. That would actually annoy me though. Like you, you could you could be shot from the right side so easily because you can't see people. How can you get into combat with a hairstyle like that? Yeah, that's pretty mean. Did they have a hairless old man? Possibly. I don't know. See that that just I find that hilarious. Yeah, that's that's too boy band. Not into that. That's just outrageously funny. It's actually outrageously funny. Depends what kind of look yeah, flock of seagulls, exactly. Depends what kind of look we're going for, really, isn't it? Can you not turn your... Oh, rotate Q and E. Oh, there we go. I'm trying to use the mouse, but... What do you think about that? It's it's tight, isn't it? It's tight and tidy. It's tight, tidy, cyber. I like it. We'll go with that. And how's your thoughts on the game so far? Uh, I've been literally playing the game like 10 minutes, dude. <laughs> I don't really have a much thought on it. Oh, I'm gone. Let's get the eyes done. Whoa, look at those. Like cat's eyes. Look at this. That's amazing. Wait, that's changing the eye brown, not the eye. Would 
We need him to look like a hacker. I reckon he has the look of a hacker. Eye colour. Or what kind of implants would he have? He wouldn't have, like, he wouldn't go green because there's not enough contrast out of green. But you could go, like, a red. Jeez, wow. Look at this. Imagine having implants like that. That's actually scary. <gasps> How would you not be terrified meeting a person like this? <laughs> and then they speak to you and they're like, no, I'm nice, really. God, man. <laughs> Go for the Scottish flag. Is that what you're calling her? Freaky, man. Yeah, I like that. We'll go with that. Right. Eyebrows. No eyebrows or very slim eyebrows. Oh, there you go. That, the super slim eyebrows. Eyebrow color. Very hard to see because they're very, they're very slim eyebrows, but kind of a green tinge to it, I think. It's not a monobrow. He's actually got a spider there. Let's get his nose right. I quite like his nose as it is, to be fair. Mouth. Oh, that's, oh, that's very. Look at that. That's very pouty. That was what it was, and that just went super pouty. I feel like he needs quite a small mouth. Not like that, you see. That just doesn't work. Yeah, I need to get... How can we get it? What number was it on? That's a bit too fish mouth. Make it... Oh, no. Oh, no. I should have paid attention to what number it was on. Number one. You feel the character screen is somewhat washed out low quality? Um, I think the resolution is down on it for some weird reason. There you go. We'll go with number three. Jaw 14. Like that actually. Although that sl slender look on his cheeks is quite nice. Yeah, I call it that. Let's go with that. Beard, not touching the beard, not touching the beard style. Hang on. Okay, so it looks completely different when you do that. Beard style. Oh, I see. Interesting. Cyberware off or on. Whoa. Now we're talking. Where's that gone? It's just suddenly scrolled. I mean, this interface is clearly geared towards a controller. <laughs> uh, Noop, uh, Noopentech, thank you for almost four years. I changed my name from NNTech. Gotcha. This is so cool, man. Look like Paul need to spend almost one hour config for this game, just like he config the truck capper. Pretty much. I think you're right, though. We only we only create this once, though, right? Quite the way that goes through those eyes. That's kind of cool. Bit too much, though. Maybe that. Or that. That looks pretty sick, actually. We'll go with that. Fight, facial scars. Not too many. He's tried to stay out of trouble, I think. He's had a few scuff ups, but nothing. Nothing too serious. Corporate life. Wow, has that put like little dots on him? Whoa. Yeah, just a little scar there. 
where he had a fight with his teddy when he was young. Robotic teddy, obviously. Where he hacked it and then the teddy attacked him. Clearly building the background story here as to why he became a hacker. <laughs> I've been hacking since the age of five. Facial scars, facial tattoos. I quite like those tattoos, actually. Ooh, now that's interesting. That's that's very interesting. I like that. Uh, you don't have to change it once you go into the mirror in the game. Oh, you can mess about with it later. That's interesting. One. Yeah, you see, this works. This this matches what's going on here. I like this. No, we'll stick with the gold. I like that. I like the double stud here and here. That's pretty sick. Piercing color, gold, fine, teeth. Wait, did he just move his mouth open? <laughs> you know when you got the dentist? And he asks you to smile so he can like... That's literally what he does when you do this. Why has he got like pink teeth that doesn't look normal gold teeth that's where you want to be that's normal shows your teeth man there you go number two number three number two clearly no what he's brushing with that new gold toothpaste that's what it is i think it's called gold gate or something gold gate toothpaste and it makes your teeth go gold eye makeup quite like it as it is we'll have a look can you have vampire teeth i don't know dude that's like a strange blue highlight eye makeup color oh i see oh wait a minute can we get gold in that i put gold in that Ooh. Oh yeah, look at this. Now we're talking. Lip makeup. So we can do the lip. It's um nah. We won't we won't go with that. Cheek makeup. I'm, I'm quite happy with where he is right now. Blemishes. Are there those little dot things going on? Yeah, just one or two. Blemish color. Yeah, that's fine. Nails. Now, do you reckon he should have green nails or gold nails? I believe you can build relationships game with AI. We'll see. Nail color. Let's get the color right. So we either go with like a green. What the heck? That's not green. Dude, that's not green. How does that work? Ooh. You reckon gold? Well, there's also like a gold pattern, so we can go like straight gold. I kind of feel like that or that looks a bit better. Maybe that one, actually. Nails long, short. I'm thinking short, like long nails and hacking keyboards, like this just doesn't work, does it? Nipples. Okay. Look. Dude, can we like zoom in? Why does it zoom out? <laughs> On or off? Uh we'll say off. He's had him cybernetically removed. Body tattoos. To... Some cake? Yeah, some cake could be great. Mr. YouTube fan, thank you. Family friendly. Oh yeah, this game's family friendly. Body scars. I mean, how serious did it get between him and his hack teddy? That's the question. I think it was probably body scars as well. Genitals on or off. Eh. 
I mean, wait, what? <laughs> Give this guy a vagina, okay. <laughs> we'll just have those off. We don't need to dwell on that. Unavailable. Right, next. Uh, body. Let's see. Body terms. Oh, hang on. This is stat. In points available, seven. Right, so we're rolling stats now. So I've got body, intelligence, reflex, technical ability, and cool. Technical ability needs to be high. Represents your technical know-how, uh, how you unlock doors, use tech weapons. Each increase will increase your armor by 5% somehow. So we'll put some points in this. What's the maximum you can have? Six. We're going to max out his tech. Cool determines your resilience, composure, and effectiveness in operating from stealth. Each level of cool will increase crit damage by 2%. Increase resistances by one. Increase stealth damage by ten percent. That's a lot. If you have five percent, if you have five points in stealth, in cool, and you kill somebody from or hit somebody from stealth mode, you're going to do an extra fifty percent damage with an extra with a ten percent crit. That's pretty amazing. Reduce the speed at which enemies detect you in stealth. Increase man mono wire damage by three. I take it mono wires like piano wire, like go behind them maybe and. Choke them out. I feel like this dude needs to be a muscle beast. I don't know. I, I'm kind of... I want to go down the stealth techie hacker hyper... Hyper? Is that even a word? Cyber hacking route. I need to see what else we've got. Reflex to determine maneuverability. Um, in addition to increasing your overall movement speed, each level of reflexes will increase your passive evasion from enemy attacks. Increase ch That's another crit chance. Damage from Mantis Blades. That ain't all that. Passive evasion's fine, but that's not an amazing set of reflexes. TCS Nico, that time again. Thank you, mate. Thank you, Nico, for almost two years. Uh, Mikey, sorry for... I didn't see your 37 months, mate. Well, time to push the button. Didn't know they put Jedward in this game. <laughs> Dude, that's not Jedward. I've decided that this game is not for me. I will see you on <coughs> Sunday. Take care, Paul and Nutters. I'm playing the game on Sunday as well. Thank you, Anonymous Moose. No problem, mate. Uh, reflexes, intelligence. Determines your net running proficiency. Each level of intelligence will increase the cyber deck RAM capacity by 4%. Increase quick hack damage by 0.5. Increase quick hack duration by 1%. We need points in intelligence. Absolutely. Body determines your raw physical power. In addition to allowing you to force doors open, each level of body starting with three will add five points of health, three points of stamina, damage with fists and gorilla arms, increased damage with melee weapons, increased movement while grappling. That's a lot. I feel like, you know, you can have points in there somewhere. Although I need to get points in cool for the stealth, don't I? So we're going to have to sacrifice something. We'll drop one out and drop it in there, maybe. Uh, Mr. Wallex, thank you for gifting a sub to Aussie Roo. Welcome, Aussie. So I'm thinking we've got our technical ability maxed out for now. Maybe it can go higher later. We've got cool. That gives us 8% crit damage. Increases stealth damage by 40%. Uh, Dave, it comes on if you've got more than 300 bits donated. Uh, technical ability represents your technical... We're just trying it out, Dave. That's maxed out. That one is on three. I don't I don't really... Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. This one is your crit chance. This one is your crit damage. But stealth is important for us. All right, we'll go with that. Bio monitor panel complete. If you live the corporate world of lives, few are still with the souls intact. Blah blah blah. Attributes five. So there you go. That is Alias V. Wait, can I not change his name? What a lovely chap. Oh, yeah. Do we get to name this guy or not? V. 
V is your name. God. Why V? We should be able to pick from 26 letters. Let's go. Could be a Veruca. It took him eight years to pick that name, Alex. Here we are in corporate world. <coughs> Not now, Jackie. I'm throwing up. V, you there? Yeah. <coughs> yeah, I'm here. You all right? <sighs> Fine. Just uh, needed a breather. That suit sounded like you blew your guts airlock. Yeah, I barfed. It's just stress. Uh, don't worry, I'm not dead yet. Exactly. Yet. Anyway, what's going on? Is there a problem? We had a leak. My boss called. Dragged me in because we had to intervene. Everyone at Night City HQ is on edge. But no way you're fucked, right? You're the one who fixes other people's shit. Jackie, if you work in our Arasaka counter intel, you're always fucked. Don't worry about me. I'll manage on my own. Buena suerte. Uh, pay close attention to tutorials to learn more about the basic mechanics. If you've already experienced that runner, feel free to disable hints. Go to the database anytime during the game to access tutorials as well as read up on the most important topics. Okay. Right, that's... No, that's... That's... Is that tearing for you or not? It's tearing for me. Please think on. Okay, we'll have to move that. What's that like for you? Motion blur's on high. It's not the motion blur, it's the V-Sync I'm worried about. Are you getting screen tearing at all? We're scared, right? Motion blur, what was that? Say no to motion blur. Imagine when you can come into bathrooms and they look like this. Like flipping computers at this screen, look at this. You go to the sink and there's computers there, it's just nuts. You've got no idea what screen tearing or VSync is, that's fine. Active job objectives are marked in your HUD or on the minimap. This is where you get bombarded with information now. They don't look like terribly customized, do they? I suppose that's corporate life for you. Ending a string of attacks and executing those responsible. Jesus, the Eurasian markets are going wild. Not to mention London, Zurich, Warsaw. <sighs> yep. It's disintegrating. Everyone's reacting to this leak. Markets down, arms transport stalled, ops in retreat, months of work FPS. out the window. Counter intel's in the grinder. If it's only going to pull 60 FPS, there's not much point pushing it higher anyway. Wait, what? I can only V-Sync to like... Okay, that's absurd. 
It won't let me V-Sync to 60. <laughs> hey. Yeah, nobody's reacting. Like, in, in GTA, people would react to you when you walked up to them and start going, what do you want? Whereas... Do you think Japan will find out? About what? About Frankfurt. I mean, it's a small leak, but still. I mean, if somebody was up Hell in your grill. Knows. Where'd you hear this? Assume Japan knows everything. It's a little bit on rails, that bit. Safe is that Nah, I just went for a bloke. Head to Jenkins' office. From an early age, Saburo was heavily involved in the business his father had founded. Christ, Fee, you were supposed to be here an hour ago. I got held up. Got held up, but I'll be right there. Fucking Frankfurt. That Abernathy bitch will probably dump it in our laps. Ugh, hanging up. I'll be in my office. You hurry up. What's with all the, like, Japanese war footage? With 20 confirmed aerial victories, late already. Will be as one of the Mr. Cowie, thank you for 63 months, sir. Oh, man. Nice suit, dude. I like the gloves. Militech hit three of ours. Now we're evacuating the rest of our facilities in that part of Europe. What's the status of the three? They're dead. Once everyone else is safe, we'll issue a statement to the media. Saying what? A tragic accident during routine security system maintenance would be my bet. I don't feel the company's founder, eh? Mr. Jenkins asked for you. He's in his office. Whoa. Hey. It's been ages. All right, bro. One sec. Look at that. Imagine working in a room like that. Are they developing Inversion photographs? Protocols active. We'll no, it's cool. I want to talk now, bro. Oh, come on. <laughs> that was rude, but okay. Where were we? <laughs> I didn't know you were in Night City. How have you been? Uh, you know how it is. A week ago, I was still in Cape Town. I heard your encounter intel. You must have a shit show on your hands right now after Frankfurt. Jenkins is your lead, right? Is he what everyone says he is? Uh... Tell me about the op in Cape Town. Operation Cargo. You know about it? Nope. Arming local conflicts in Africa. Yeah. I didn't know that was you. It was me. We dumped crates full of rifles into the ocean. They had to be pulled out using borrowed fishing boats. Same old circus, but hey, that's how wars are won. What's everyone say about Jenkins? That he's effective, like any psychopath. <laughs> Apparently, he's gone a little crazier lately. Hey, he's in a tough spot. The director was supposed to greenlight his promotion when the Japanese arrived. She stabbed him in the back instead. Look at the battery on that phone. That's amazing. That must last like six months. And you, who do you work under? Abernathy. She's really good. Came up with the whole Cape Town ploy on her own. Abernathy. The bitch who burned my boss in the promotion to Spec Ops Director. You know how it is. Things happen. Yeah. They do indeed. Listen, sorry. Uh, in a bit of a rush right now. We'll talk another time, okay? Sure, sure. Good seeing you again. Job update at the Corpo Rat. Yeah, let me try, um... Seeing if the... Put that on 60. I don't think that's going to make any difference to this. No, this is pretty fixed. That's such a bizarre... I don't even get how that works. Like, 144 is my monitor's refresh, and then it goes 72, which is half, and then it goes 48. Is that, huh? It's literally gone, oh, your monitor's refresh. Let me do half of that and half of that again. We'll just do that. Oh, yeah, it's smooth enough. That'll do. Right, what are we doing? What are we hacking into? Is that is that your Tesco order? Oh, my God, love. 
What language is this? Jeez. She's obviously got a higher level hacking ability than I have. I can't even understand that, Tesco order. Yeah, I reckon after a while your eyes would go pretty weird if you worked in an office like that. They'll make sure that stops at three. Look at that girl on the end with the like the red thing. Bastard. He lobbied them hard for it when they flew in from Tokyo. <laughs> Director of special operations with his file. <laughs> the Japanese might buy it. I mean, the game's feeding me backstory at the moment, but it's the stooge way it's doing it. I'm not some massive... You know, they're just completely ignoring us. Can we actually go in, though? What, can I pour a coffee? Oh. Where's the door to this room? Listen to this run? Wait. Seriously, how do you get in? There we go. Nope. Work with that prick. What do you think they're doing now? They need to mop up the leak. The company could lose a boatload. All right, Matrix. <laughs> Genuinely feel like a ghost. <laughs> Please enter the antechamber. Whoa. Visitor authorization granted. The heck did that just do? Have a seat, V. Be right with you. You have to handle this voting issue. Wait, let me just check there's no trap door underneath this seat. That's what happens when you visit bosses in James Bond. Just as we thought. You know what to do. Start now. Told you. See? Um. <laughs> Director Abernathy. I watched the note. <clears throat> what the hell was that? Donaldo, if you're just looking Deep for penises, clean. there's plenty of other places the on the Frank internet better suited. Us. As we agreed, I got rid of the problem. I told you to resolve the problem, not massacre the European Space Council. Do you understand what the cover-up will cost? Millions. We lost the license. Now we gained a week. That's a win. Path of least resistance always. No nuance has you written all over it. Don't backseat type We're not type done on. talking about this. I hate that bitch. I always have. How long have you worked together? It's not the first time she screwed you. Yeah, we don't like her. This isn't the first time Abernathy set you up. No, not the first. Smeared me in front of Japanese execs, so she'd be the one promoted to director of spec ops. A cunt. I'm glad to be out of this now seat. She's holding a gun to my head to make sure I don't try anything. But she won't pull the trigger because she needs me. I do what she doesn't have the guts to do. Have a drink. Divide and conquer. Effective strategy. <sighs> Effective. What would you do in my position? I'd have a drink and I'd give one to my friend. You have to defend yourself. Remind Abernathy you're not her doormat. You're right. Smack her once, but hard. She'll respect you. Seems we see eye to eye on this issue. Yeah, violence is key. <laughs> Plus one for violence. Give me, a, give me a nice. Give take me a, this. Ooh. Take shard. A data shard. Proof of my trust. Go on, take it. It's a USB stick. Is it USB three? It's what I've collected over the past weeks. Biometrics, trauma team card, names of her closest associates, driver, chief of security, lover, lover's husband, everything. Use it and make sure Abernathy won't be a problem anymore. You said it. 
I need to defend myself. Yeah. If anyone finds out we even talked about this, I'll go down with you. That's true. But everyone knows you only made it to where you are thanks to me. So it's not like they could ever believe you played no part in it. Um, was the option to just say okay? What'll happen if I refuse? Don't ask stupid questions. This isn't a request, V. <laughs> we seem to understand each other. Take this, too. Oh, he just happens to have it under the table. Credit ship transactions are traceable. Paper disappears as soon as you spend it. What can I say? Can I have Bitcoin instead? Use this money only. Find the right people for the job. No corporate affiliation. And for the core task, use someone you know inside out. Are we clear? Yeah, I think we're clear. Untraceable. Good. In that case, I'll await your report. And good luck with it. I'm all right, Mikey. I have my AV waiting outside. It's yours to use. You've got your audio and video. don't disappoint me. <gasps> AV's 10 out of 10. Jenkins, Night City Counter Intel. Why is the giant fish floating outside? Procedures for lunar-based licenses. Yes. Yes, the Sea of Clouds. Oh, he's talking to somebody else. I was trying to work out why there's a giant goldfish floating around outside. Earthly jurisdiction. Right, let's get out of here. So basically, he wants us to take apart that woman's connections and her, and use cash to do it. Untraceable. Can you play the stock market game? I don't know, dude. That'd be so cool. You asked for? Uh, you late? Was supposed to be ready yesterday. I I know, but I I have them now. Send them to my inbox, and you and I will have a word about this later. Hey V, you alive? I'll stink to the Viper Pit. Cool. Viper Pit. Couldn't have said it better. You in some trouble? Not yet. Right now, I just need a soul I can trust. That kind of sounded like a yes. Meet me at Lizzie's. Be there in an hour. Is this the ROG booth? <laughs> what is this? Oh, can we get... Look at how many monitors? Look, he's got a super wide screen. I tell you what, they're pretty chunky monitors. What is what is going on? 2077? I thought we'd be down to like this thick. But no, we've gone retro. Six monitors up here. A super ultra wide. Open drawer, stand or use. Let's have a look in the drawer. Uh, pick up card. Trauma team. Okay. Can I keep it? Use cognitive booster. Sure, why not? Sure, it's legal. Okay. What are we doing? Files, messages. Files, report, summary. Uh, thank you, monkey boy. Thank you for subbing. Uh, after accessing data collected from contact reports in Utah, Nevada, Arizona, Montana, we can confirm any active. Uh, same conclusion can be drawn regarding repressive threats and Miltech. Conclusion. Further humint. Humint gathered required. Current data are circumstantial. Do not allow the industry to conclusions. No. I don't know. I want to click on that. Go on. Can I go to... Why can't I scroll? I can't go to messages. There we go. Messages. Vaccination with new space. I don't think it was a health thing. I reckon that was a cognitive booster, so it probably um, temporarily improves your mental faculties, I think. So if you're trying to do like a hacking check, maybe it gives you an increased chance is what I'm guessing. 
We're pleased to announce that the opening of a new space in our new in our Night City headquarters, our scientists have meticulously curated authentic rainforest flora and fauna in designing our very own experimental self-sustaining ecosystem. More details soon. Post-mortem Operation Wormy Apple. Uh, the meeting of the Department of Operational Oversight Committee finds as follows regarding Operation Wormy Apple. It was executed without proper procedure. Uh, success is solely due to the fact the Petrochem committed errors which proved costly. We find the death of the Prague contact. Toxin-induced cardiac arrest are direct results of poor planning. Investigate all stages of the operation planning from reconnaissance to implementation with the aim of isolating irregularities. I don't know if any of this stuff affects us yet. Uh, quantified Satori. Your biodata indicators are reading abnormally. High levels of cortisol, uh, catecholamine, and adrenaline persist from previous results. Hormone blocker usage is prescribed for only two weeks before requiring a baseline reset. Recommendation, meet with your trainer to prepare a recovery plan. Vacation with the stars, unbeatable offers. Have you ever been to Thailand, Morocco, or Alaska more times than you can count? <laughs> Crystal Palace is offering a once-in-a-life opportunity to book an Earthview apartment along with a cosmic, cosmically gargantuan selection of vouchers. <laughs> what? Okay. We've done files. Net. News. WNS News. Asbestos found in Miltec implants. Wait, how do we go? Where's the back button? Delamin, leave your problems at the door. No idea if this stuff is relevant yet. Goes Crystal Palace. Ten casinos and five pools. Go to the AV garage. I need your stamp on something. It's possible one of our assets was exposed. Is it Frankfurt again? No, different issue. Local. Tell me. Quick version. Our agent at Biotechnica suspects they might be on to him. They recently granted him red security clearance. That's top. He's been fishing for dirt, but it's been slow. Your point? They're clean. Like we run orphanages clean, bleach server clean. We suspect they flagged him and are feeding him phony data. Should we green light Xfil or let him keep looking? Pull him out, but calmly. Don't raise any eyebrows. Otherwise, they'll catch on. Jenkins will be livid. I'll handle Jenkins. Understood. He's got a weird way of typing. Are we supposed to do something over at this place? I feel like we didn't really do anything. Read. What's this? Tracking down Netrunner Renegades, combating demons, rebuilding the American Net. Is a walk in the park for you. Here's what you can expect as a contribute to Netwatch Agent. Thanks to Netwatch, thousands of people can freely use approved search engines. Approved search engines? I don't like the sound of that. Do you have what it takes? Fly today. There's nothing else to do here, I don't think. No running in the office. No, I didn't say anything of the sort. What's that thing on her head? That's right. No comment. How many times do I have to say it? Oh, wow. Look at that jacket. That ja This guy likes gold more than I do. Did you see the report on the vote? I mean, shit. The world's going to tear us apart when the word gets around. 
The world's never going to find out. And the few who do know the truth, they won't know it for long. Access granted. What if I just turn around and bend over when the scan machine fires up? What do you think? <laughs> scan this. <laughs> Is this our taxi then? I like this. Is this a Tesla? The view Please sucks though. Your destination. Uh bring up district analytics first. Bring up district analytics. Increased NCPD presence and activity has been reported in Haywood. No official statement has been forthcoming. Intercepted radio communications suggest MaxTAC has been sent to the area. A widespread power failure has been reported in Santo Domingo. All other districts exhibit activity within expected parameters. Uh, Alexa, play. <laughs> Destination, Lizzie's Bar. Noted. En route. Oh, nice. But a champers. Let's do this. It's the rain now. If it just rained, it'd be like Blade Runner. Hello, V. Yes? We weren't scheduled to connect till the end of the week. Quantified Satori received notification of I a somewhat can... troubling biometric reading. I felt I should call. Is everything in order? Uh... I'm dealing with a temporary nuisance. Nothing you should worry about. Just think back to our last session. The neuromotor relaxation exercises three times a day, they'll soothe and lift your spirit. I know this. Yeah, okay, bro. Sure, okay. See you later. <laughs> the Amber Fox. We need to go to the Amber Fox. Can I have another drink? I can't click on stuff. Like, you need to have a menu option before you can have a drink. What is that advert? <laughs> no designated landing site has been detected at the destination. Find a spot close to the bar, as close as you can. Fuck procedures. Initiating landing sequence based on new parameters. Oh, this is looking nice with all the neon stuff. It's quite a nice little intro, isn't it? Because it gives you a quick tour of the city. Psychosu, this looked like a landing pad to you. Could have fucking crushed us. Jesus Christ. Okay, no, no, hey, we, we ain't looking for no beef with you. Good. Man in gold trousers. Oh, hey, why is this happening? Seems trouble once in. What the heck is she wearing? Keep an eye on the AV for me, will you? I don't get paid to do that. I sure. wasn't asking. I'm not a scratch on it when I get back. Welcome to Lizzie's. 
I tell you what, you don't want this girl to put her elbows on your table. Because that would do some serious damage. We're in Lizzie's bar. Why is everybody just dressed in bizarre outfits? Oh, fuck off. Okay. <laughs> Have a poke around. No future. Wait, what did I just take? I just took something out of a urinal, what the heck? Oh, it's just the number two room. A guitar pick. Ew. Ew. <laughs> it was in between. I don't care. It's probably got splash marks on it. Ew. I the tiger, babe. Wait, you know I the tiger? You know it was a song. Why don't you lick my ass, hey? Jeez, you're nice. <laughs> Can't go in there. Man, this is pretty cool. Look at this. This is impressive. That's a nice outfit, bro. Can I drink that? You have uh, nothing better to are do. You lost? It's like everybody just a hundred percent unfriendly. Have I not seen you somewhere before? Sorry, James Bond villain. Uh, are you looking for someone? Well, spit it out. Oh, sorry. Never mind. Is this one of the paid for suites? What is this guy? I reckon we can find extra stuff if we poke around. Somebody's having a great time. What the fuck? What's going on? Oh, at least she wasn't hostile. Chromantico. Drink. What does that do? Take something. Titanium micro. Titanium micro plate mesh or something. You can buy a drink for 10 bucks. Yeah, I'm going to do that in a sec, but what's this do? Reduces movement speed by 10%, increases weapon accuracy by 50%. We'll take that. That could be useful in a fight. The Vampire Prince is back. Monster Hunters beware. Dracula has risen again. Okay. Euro dollars. Whoa, look at this. The decks of the future. We're supposed to meet this person down here, but I kind of feel like I want to look around a little bit first. Poke around a bit. The hat you picked up can be put on if you press I. Character. Oh boy. No, that's map. Cap with titanium microplate mesh, 4.3 armor. Equip. Level 2 requirement. I can't wear that yet.
Office blaze a 5.9 armor. Okay. We still got our corporate gear on there. We can't upgrade. Combat gadgets. What? Frontal cortex, ocular system, circulatory system, immune system. Wow. You can basically mod everything. Backpack. Looks like we need components to make things. Effective DPS. Is like like the limit of the world here then? Or we're we just not seen beyond this yet? Crafting. Upgrades. Crafted item will gain a random stat. Right, so we need some components basically to be able to make things. I guess it'll go through that, like, in the tutorial bit. It'll probably tell us how to make stuff. Yeah? What's up in the big world? What do you want? I'm fine. These people just, like, standing around. Is that a new one? Not yet. What is she doing? Doing some kind of VR thing. This is the century. This is the century. This is the I mean, go to a nightclub and then jump into VR. How weird is that? I'm off the clock, hon. Classic T pose. I have a tiger, babe. Not sure about those green plastic bits. They're a bit odd, but whatever. The only thing I don't like right now is the fact that hey, pretty much nobody uh, interacts with you. I know you. You know what I mean? Like you, see, they all Hello? stay in the same position, and then you can interact with them, and, and they say like some random thing back, but they don't move. You can't suddenly have a fight with them, or there's no side mission. A little bit on rails at the moment. Back to my place. Can I nick some stuff? Drink. Take that. Right, let's get downstairs. Something on the seat beside people sitting on the floor. find the right pixel what you slot is what you got I have no idea what this is all about some kind of story thing right where's the staircase exit You go down a floor? The music's horrible. Nightclub life, mate. Screw you. 
one staircase to go down. That sounds like a fire hazard. Mm -hmm. Some cards. Careful, mate. My, what a sweet little face pal. She actually said something nice. That's the first character that said something nice. Pretty dumped her already. Yeah, no surprise there. This is the century. Ain't nothing for this free. Is the century. This is the century. Who designed these characters? Can't you see I'm busy? You got something to tell me? Say it. Don't you, just stand there. You got something to tell me? Just say it. Don't just stand there. <laughs> That's just perfectly normal. Fuck something up. When was the last time I fucked anything up? Huh? Seriously. How far back you want me to go? This is amazing. What are they doing? Oh, she just got electrocuted. Looking for your doom. Already here. Dapping his fingers, waiting for you. Do I know you? I talk to him. Huh. Literally no option to talk. I'm off the clock. Pompous or eccentric genius? Who are we on about? Slavosh McAllister. How's it going, honey bun? I have no reason to live. Hey, cowboy. Quite literally. It's good to see you, cabron. Now sit down and tell me what's got your shorts in a knot. It's good to see you too, Jack. How you been? I got sparks flying between the Valentino boys and Maelstrom. Eddie's there for the taking. As long as you don't get flatlined. Yeah, I know how it is. Can't complain, but we ain't here to shoot the shit about me. Let me hear about this problem of yours. Jackie, before I start, this stays between us. Por supuesto. I'm serious. This thing, it could ruin me. I don't trust him. So could I. Don't trust him. You do realize who you're talking to, right? The guy who's done this before. Remember what happened in Mexico, at the border? I keep one word. I know, you saved my ass. If word about the cartels had gotten out. But it didn't. And this won't either. That's why you came to see dear old Jackie. Remember that night over Macho Grande? No, I'll never get over Macho Grande. Data shard. Take it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Won't so come cheap. It'll have to be done on the sly. No trail. Hard eddies only. Got the money. Full crew job for sure. Techie, maybe two. A runner with a gold-plated brain. And a driver with wheels from hell. Not to mention the solo. Huh. The piece I'm missing. That what you need from me? My trigger finger to zero this lady? Delicate situation, I know. That's why I need somebody I can trust. This ain't no delicate situation, hermano. It's a hit job. Plain and simple. You know how Arasaka operates. Okay, maybe you don't. This isn't a professional request I can refuse. But I can. And I am. And you should too. Now, what do you say we lick her up and talk life? Gracias, mamita. Double tequila with grenadine and lime. Nothing better for drowning nerves. To this. Was that a toast? 
the hell does that even mean? You raise a glass to your mama, your hermana. The mamacita you'll meet at the bar, but this doesn't say a damn thing. <sighs> to this. This job and all the rest of that corpo bullshit. You know what it is? Un pacto con el diablo. Been saying it all along. Soldier souls, those are Risaka fuckers. Today, they got you to zero somebody. Tomorrow, they'll get somebody else to zero you. True story. Those are the rules, Jack. You wanna be top? Gotta have some skin in the game. Yeah, but you're not on top. Saburo Arasaka is. And you're the pendejo who keeps him there. Work for yourself, live for yourself. That's the only way. Maybe someday. But for now, I'm still well within their reach. You'll always be within reach. Always re Hey, you lost? Got a problem? V, is that right? You're from Arasaka HQ. Is there a problem? Are you here about Frankfurt? We're here for you. Jenkins assigned you a task today. You'll share all the details with us. Oh, yeah. Name and department again? Didn't quite catch it first time around. Gah, fuck! How you feeling? Pretty sharp dive, huh? Your access to company networks is hereby revoked. In two minutes, any company cybernetics in your possession will cease functioning. Give us the data you received from Jenkins. This will conclude termination procedures. How the hell did you find out? <laughs> Shards on the table. That is not your concern. The data, now. I don't have an option. Information. Eat it. Shard. Eat it. Don't give it him. Smart choice. Mistake. Big mistake. We done. With the formalities? Yes. But I think Abernathy would gladly up our fee for ridding her of a piece of rot like you. Stand up. You're coming with us. Come on, move Bye it. Bye, I think you fellas might have forgotten just how far from home you are. I'm not sure this body was your style, let alone a healthy option. Is that a threat? You start shooting, maybe we join in, huh? Before you know it, somebody might die today. We have what we came for. It'll do for now. I don't I don't believe we just handed over that shard. That's just the most ridiculous thing. Why didn't our mate stop in? It's like when my little primito was ditching drugs. Nasty chills, trembling hands, cold sweat and dry heaving. Yeah. He's gone cold turkey. Sounds about right. Hey, hey, should I get you to a ripper? Or I guess maybe trauma team's on its way. TT policy's gone, Jack. So are my biochem controllers, company pad. I mean, they've seized my bank account. Not frozen, seized. Jesus, these fuckers move fast. We got cash though. You sure you feel okay though? I mean. Give me a minute. Get my shit together. Can that guy dance in the that, background? That'd be that, Jack. Just lost control of my life. Completely. I'd say you got it back. You couldn't say no to him. So they said it to you. This is a turn for the better. You'll see. Besides, you haven't lost everything. About to say I still have a friend? That's sweet. <laughs> no, dumbass. 
still got that wad for the hit job. See, told him. Probably some fat ass chunk of cha chain. Just right for a new start. That's right, fool. Buckle up. Hey, you hearing all right? Bunk. Look so hot. V, V. Hey, hermano. Your new life. It starts now.